how to fix grainy videos for free inside DaVinci Resolve. Right click on your video footage and open Infusion page. Then highlight your media one, press Ctrl spacebar and then you can type remove noise. Then click on here to enable both viewers. Then highlight media one and press one and then media out and then press number two. That way you're previewing media in and out on the left and the right side. And zooming in for better understanding of what we're doing. I'm adjusting the second window and we're ready to begin. We're highlighting this remove noise node that we have just added. Then you can select this drop down menu right here and just beneath the color you can select red. That way your media out will be currently on black and white without any color. Now we can continue to inspector which is on the right side and we're gonna start out with the first field which is softness red. You want to increase that values of your liking depend on your footage but don't overdo it because it's gonna be too blurry. After adjusting softness red, you can go down and find detail red. This is something like a sharpening, so you want to increase this by a tiny bit. It is all based on your footage. Then go to softness green and increase it of your liking and then go detail green and do the same as you did for the red. Then go to softness blue, increase the values of your liking again and then go to detail blue and adjust it the final touch. And after you finish adjusting all the softness and detail of RGB colors, which is by the way all depending on your footage. The values of my settings is currently what is working for my footage. And when you're done adjusting the color settings, you can go back to the same setting on the drop down menu and then you can select the color. As you can see, it is already looking better. And now we need to adjust the finishing touch by going to chroma and we're gonna increase the values of softness luma. So I'm increasing its values by a tiny bit around here. And then I'm going to detail luma right here and also increasing the values by a tiny bit but not so much as the softness luma. And lastly we're going to softness chroma. We can increase that actually a little bit more than the previous one around here in the middle and also increase the details right around with the same values. Just remember when you're adjusting the values of these settings that you're constantly looking at your media out which is on the right viewer so you can preview what the changes are actually doing. Now when I'm done I can actually see the preview of before and after. You can see how grainy it was it before and how it turned out to be a little bit clear. And remember to not overdo it since it's gonna become too blurry. You can watch this video right here. I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.